Hello, everybody. Welcome to this week's Celebration Assembly. Week's flown by again, and we've only got one week left until our half-term break. Absolutely flown by. Right, let's get started. We've got lots and lots to get through today. I've seen lots of people this week with things that have been going on outside school. Uh, first up is this. This painting is by Lily. Thank you, Lily. Uh, this is a painting uh, for Falcon and it hangs in my office now. Uh, and there's a little picture of me on it. So thank you for that. That really brightened my day when you brought that to me this week. Uh, and as I said, it's hanging on the wall in my office. Thank you. Mrs. Barber's Running Club is uh, moving along very, very nicely. And during the week, children uh, do laps of our school field doing our Falcon Mile. So I've got some certificates. These are our Bronze Cross Country Awards. And this is for running 10 miles. That is a very, very long way. So first up, I'd like to say congratulations to Molly. Well done, Molly, on your running. And next, we've got Ty. Well done to you, Ty, 10 miles. Next up, Hayden, congratulations to you on your bronze cross country award. Daniel, you're next, 10 miles, well done, it's a very long way. And then finally, Freddie, well done for you, 10 miles for you too. Our next certificate is for rugby, and this is for Charlie, who's in year three. Well done, Charlie, player of the month award at Norwich Rugby Club. That is a great achievement and a fantastic sport to be playing at the weekend. Here we have a football trophy, and this is for Stanley. Well done, Stanley. This is for playing for Sprouston Football Club. Uh, well done for doing that at the weekend. I'm actually in Sprouston tomorrow. Uh, my daughter's playing against Sprouston under 13, so I know a little bit about Sprouston Football Club. Well done to you, Stanley. Now, I've never had one of these in assembly before, and this is for Isaac. Congratulations to you, Isaac. This is a first place in a dog show, which took place at the Norfolk Showground. So well done. Got this lovely rosette for the dog show. Alicia in the Kingfishers has been doing some DT at home, and she's been working with her TYs to make this Halloween-themed piece of work. Finley's been to see me. He completed the summer reading challenge. Well done to you, Finley. Uh, and I know you've got your credit for this. So well done. Please don't forget, everybody, if you've done the reading challenge, you need to be getting your credits with your teachers. And here's a late entry for the assembly. Well done to you, Cassie, on, you, on doing the reading challenge as well. Next, we've got some beautiful handwriting. Uh, and these came down from Firecrest during the week. So uh, well done to you, Hannah. Absolutely beautiful handwriting here. Thank you for sharing this with me. And same with you, Sophia. Lovely writing. Thank you for coming down and showing me these. And next is Jaden in Firecrest. Well done. This is for the volume of work you've produced. And you did it all independently. So well done, Jaden. That's an excellent effort. Uh, here we've got a trophy for ballet. It's not often we see ballet in assembly. So congratulations goes to Scarlet in Kingfishers for achieving this. And I know you've been helping others with their ballet work. And lastly this week, well done Summer in Year 6 for getting your Green Blue Peter badge. Well done. And I know you've been picking up litter at Whitlingham and you've done four weeks worth of recycling as well to earn your badge. Congratulations to you. Uh, we have one Falcon star this week. It's a bronze star. Don't forget, this is for getting for nine credits. And with the nine credits, you also get the Falcon Junior bookmark. So this week, congratulations to Harry. Well done, Harry, on getting your bronze award. Our uh, Falcon flies this week, still looking at the Falcon value of kindness. So let's start in year six this week. Uh, Eagles, it goes to Leo. Well done, Leo, for giving up his own time to litter pick on many occasions and doing a fantastic job of looking after our green spaces. That's great. In uh, Robbins, it's Anastasia. Well done to you. Always thinking of others and offers to help if peers are uh, down or in need. Uh, she's a pleasure to work with. In the Doves, Reuben. Have, uh, for leaving a beautiful card on Mrs. Harrod's desk and making her day. It's amazing what a lovely comment can do to add happiness to someone else's day. Thank you. And lastly, in Canaries, Daisy May, always being polite, uh, asking ad adults how they are and being kind to every single member of the class. Well done. Year five next for our Flies for Kindness in the Goldfinches is Daily. Uh, she helps and looks out for others and is always kind to everyone. Well done to you. In the Firecrest, Jaden, 
being helpful and kindly explaining learning tasks to his classmates. Well done. In the Swiss, it's Lily. Being a lovely friend at all times and caring for other things by returning lost items to the teacher so they can be reunited with their owner. And finally, in Bittens, it's Lacey, incredibly kind and supportive to others. Year four flyers for kindness. Here we go. Hummingbirds, Lily May, well done to you. Uh, always helps her partner when she needs it and will be there for everyone. In the Linnets, Riley Sharp. Uh, always holding doors open for staff uh, and peers as well. Well done. In the Peacocks, Esme, uh, always being so kind and caring towards her classmates, being the first to console other children who are upset on the playground. Uh, and lastly, in Flamingos, it's Logan, for being thoughtful and looking out for others without being asked and without being prompted. Well done, Year 4. And finally, Year 3 Flyers for Kindness. Let's start in the Wrens. This week it's Tom. Tom is exceptionally friendly to his classmates and is always keen to help those in need. Well done to you, Tom. In the Kingfishers, it's Charlie. Well done, Charlie. Kind, helpful to everyone and considerate to his partner and the table group. In the Puffins, it's Imogen. Imogen is always keen to help and is a good friend to everyone. And lastly, in the Jays, it's Danielle. Always very polite and ready to offer help to anyone and everyone. She is kind and friendly to all. Our birthdays this week. Happy birthday to Henry in Bittens on the 10th of October, you were 10, and Poppy and Jay's, you were 8. Happy birthday to you. 12th of October, George in Canaries, you were 11. Samuel in Flamingos, you were 9, and Charlie in Kimfish, you were 8. Happy birthday. 13th of October, Jake in Robbins, you were 11. Imogen in Bittens, you were 10. Jack in Linnets, you were nine, and Dylan in Kingfishers, you were eight. Happy birthday to all of you. On the 14th of October, Annie in Puffins, you were eight, and today, happy birthday in Flamingos, it's Jensen. 15th of October, you are nine. On the staff this week, happy birthday, Mrs Hunter, 10th of October. There we go, that's another celebration assembly done. Well done to everybody this week, it's been a lovely week. Next week, as I said, is our last week before half term. So we'll have a great week next week as well. Well done to the Falcon football team this week. 4-2 win over Old Catton. Well done to you. Congratulations. Uh, have a lovely weekend, everybody. And uh, we'll see you again on Monday. Bye, everyone.